Yo, what's up everyone? In today's video, we're gonna make a guide for Goal, the new blue lock game. So, yeah, we're gonna explain everything. So, without further ado, let's get right into the video. Okay, so first of all, we have the customize, right? When you first join into the game, you should probably get here. You will have some codes probably. You, you will have a hair color that doesn't matter that much, or a co color doesn't mat matter as much as, like, yeah, it doesn't. Height, the, the taller you are, the more power you have. But the shorter you are, the, the faster you are, right? Easy, okay? So the only way to get Prodigy, um, is by like just joining the game you have five percent and the, the only other way is probably uh like prestiging to level 10 and like you have a chance of getting prodigy i'm not sure about that don't don't take my word okay like prodigy gives you like three badges uh, like immediately if i'm not mistaken also you got like three dribbles i think so yeah you also have like no look you have the badges i have no look right now I'm gonna explain the badges later, you can spill, spin all of these stuff, so yeah, you also have stat points, all of that, all of them are like self-explanatory, right, speed, muscle, stamina, dribble, goalkeeper, re reaction, and power, you cannot put the, sp put stats in right now, so yeah, even if you click, it doesn't matter, so yeah, okay, so next we go to explain the, the keybinds and the but buttons and all that shit so yeah let's go okay before the video continues make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more stuff from goal and yeah that's it let's go okay so here we are we're in game right first of all i'm gonna go, i'm gonna explain the, the the energy bar and the stamina bar like the, when you run you waste stamina right also when you jump and when you dash so that's it right you regain stamina by by just not doing anything right and you regain energy when you finish the match and get like a energy drink or whatever this 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 is i guess right and yeah you can drink this stuff and you will regain your energy you see it's just a little bit but you can still see that so yeah next thing how to shoot okay you hold you hold left uh, left click right you just aim when you want to shoot and you shoot simple right there's also uh like different different ways of shooting i guess but it's kind of hard for new players to get it like you can like lob the, the ball right with lobs you, you can do something like this and you can shoot it that's also a pretty decent uh, pretty decent like way to shoot and there's so there's also uh, like volleys which are pretty cool to do like you press v twice you run and you can either uh, like volley with uh, q or e so yeah and you you might need to click like if you want to the ball to go to the left you will like click like like this okay and you just clicked and you it the ball goes to the left but it's kind of weird to time it so do what you want with that i guess like this you see pretty pretty cool the wall is really decent there's also like headers like with t but it doesn't work i'm not sure so yeah uh next off we got the dribbles you dribble with z x c and v all of the all of them are like dribbles we already saw like how to rabona right next is like whatever this is like a spin i guess next is like a left step back i guess uh step over if i'm not mistaken we got this and you can do many many dribbles i'm gonna just show show them on the screen right now so you guys can see Next off is probably like the goalie. The goalie is pretty hard to do. You press G when you want to equip your gloves. 
Okay, why is my character like this? What the fuck? Okay, that's good. So, when you have like uh, someone attacking you, like from there, let's say, and you wanna defend this side, right? And he will probably shoot around here. You press C and then E, because you will save both of the shots. Because you can have like this on Q, this on E, this is on Z, and this one's on C. Simple, right? If you want to catch the ball, like it's going towards you, you catch with F. You can also jump catch, like that. And yeah, that's probably it for the goalies. I'm also show the, um, the keybinds for goalies, so the controls. So yeah, next thing, uh, probably passes, right? You can, wait, fuck. You can pass with um, one, two, and three. One is short pass. And you press E. You just pass, right? Next one is like medium pass. And the, the, the last one is long pass. Which is probably like the longest, right? Of course. Yeah, there you go. And you can also pass with like the shooting, like something like this, I guess. If the person is there. That, that also works a lot of the time, which is r really decent. You can also pass with Q, like it's a little lob pass, I guess. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool, pretty cool, to be honest. Like, that's that's probably one of the ways to score. Like, if there's one person, like, here, and you are passing from, let's say, right there, you do this with, like, R. You, uh, you press R, and it's like a little ping. So, if the person is right here, and you're right there. He passes to you, and you can probably e either volley, or just catch the ball and shoot. Right? Like, if there's a goalkeeper, what my badge uh, makes me do is like this, and you can switch. You see, that's pretty, pretty amazing. Like, the badges are pretty cool. So, I think I didn't forget uh, anything uh, for... Yeah, also, oh, oh, yeah, I forgot the slides. You, you can tackle like that to get the ball from the person that's dribbling. And you can slide tackle like this. You run, you run on shift, and you slide tackle with left, uh, left click. You do this like left click, slide tackle, you run, and left click. Simple, okay? You also um, dash with T and... The controls are those, I think. There's nothing else for me to say about the controls. So yeah, let's go next off with the badges. Yo. Okay, so we're on the Trello right now. So yeah, I'm gonna put the Trello in the description into the on the video. So yeah. First of all, accelerator. When shooting, you do a small dash to the left or, or right. You, that, you do that with A or D. Okay, I had this, but it's not the best one, so... It's meh, I guess. Don't don't like use it. Uh, ac acrobatic, pretty good, pretty good, honestly. Like the the ability uh, you use abilities on B, I think. So you press B and teleports the ball within you uh, within the area of 10 to 15 studs. Okay, that's pretty cool. Passive, able to do perfect volleys. That's really cool. I had acrobatic, but I uh, I spinned it. Pretty pretty dumb of me, but it's all good. Airborne, able to move in air, in the air longer, less gravity, kind of ass, I guess. Airfoot, able to dribble mid-air. Okay, that's that's decent. I've seen some players use that. It's cool. Okay, we saw that. That's airfoot. Ball awareness, able to see where the ball is landing, and if you go where the ball is landing, you have the more you have more team assistance mag. Okay, this is okay, but it's like nothing nothing cool. Increases the frames distance of ankle break. Break. Okay, yeah. Like when someone dribbles, right as you left click, you, you can get ankle broken. That's that's pretty goofy, but it's okay. It, it's it's nothing serious, right? Just chill. Catch. Uh, this is a goalkeeper ability. Creates a barrier in the goal that allows you to catch any ball. That's pretty decent. Carry ball. 
Activate badge, can charge while running and kick with R without slowing the character. Have a buff at power while using the skill. This one is pretty cool. Like honestly, I've seen some players with this and it's broken, right? You can fake shot by clicking M2 once uh, your shot is charged. This can be okay in like some situation situations, but it's not that good, okay? Penalty badge removes shakiness, penalty system, not that yet. Okay, this this doesn't work, right? It's it's useless, I guess. Copy. Able to mimic a badge, but not a, not at its full potential. Okay, that's cool, but I haven't seen anyone use that. Have a slight dash once tackling someone. And this looks cool, I guess, but I haven't used it, so I can't say anything about it. Uh, your passes have more assistance to it, more mag. Fair enough, it's probably like for a midfielder, pretty cool. This one is a goalie one, gives you 25% uh, more to catch the ball instead of just hitting it after the block. That's pretty cool. Uh, pa uh, passive, it's a passive dribbler, buffs dribble, increases range. That, that, that one is decent, yo, that's actually cool. Eyes of God, this is for like midfielders, it's really good. Like you cannot get ankled, gives you a bigger steal range and a bigger interception range to your teammates. This is the ability. In the passive is give you steel range and bigger pass receive hitbox. Pretty cool, pretty pretty cool, right? Faster movement covers more area when dashing. On, um, eh, it's okay I guess. Faster reaction charges meter two times faster. It's okay, nothing nothing fa nothing special I guess. Faster starter. Faster shot gives you max acceleration and dash when sprinting. It happens every time you sprint after 40 seconds. Goofy stuff, you can only use it about like, what, six or seven times in a game. So it's like, okay. Finger roll increases your hitbox as a goalie. This one is really good for goalies. So yeah. Formless shooter, able to shoot while jumping. Okay, this one, this one goes fucking crazy, man. Like if you have this, and you're a striker, don't sh don't like spin it, bro. It's really good. Forward increases your power when kicking or shooting the ball, ten to twenty plus power. This is good. I haven't seen anyone use it. Maybe like, I I have actually like people that have like, a hundred and fifteen power, they have forward for sure. Gain if you have another badge in another badge slot, you gain twenty. 5% power boost this one is good for like if you're a prodigy or if you have like a second badge that's pretty cool ghost passive immune to team badge barges okay it's okay but it's nothing special last one you have higher chance of getting injured this one is a troll this one is a tro troll one there are like some troll ones so yeah additional speed in the middle of the pitch useless shit fucking spin it if you get it iron body Allows you to steal the ball by touching the person. This one is good. This one is good for defen defenders. Lockdown area. Gives you more speed inside the goalkeeper area. This is pretty, pretty good. So, yeah. Longer, uh, stronger power when shooting outside, the bo outside of the box. But, I, I mean, it's okay. But, I, I don't know. Like, meh. Long lag. Buffs the range of stand tackle. This is pretty, pretty okay for defending no fumble you don't lose the ball after you punish yourself for using a dribble without having any dribble bar left like there there are dribble bars there are like two for people right and there are three for prodigies i'm not sure about this but i think it's like that and like if you lose them and you dribble you're gonna lose the ball simple stuff no look this is what i have like you're able to shoot with shift lock in any di direction without having to phase away you're shooting from you equip shift shift lock and you can sh like aim better but people can see where you aim no look it's not the same yeah like you can switch and they won't see that it's it's pretty good cool. it's pretty pretty good i guess yeah uh per perimeter area makes a wind cyclone that if you're inside of it you gain additional speed this this one is decent i've seen people use it i guess yeah it's okay it's okay pressure defense circle that follows you and boosts your contest range and amount pretty pretty okay 
rapid fire this one is also decent able to shoot while dri uh, dribbling and right after with a two charge meter bar this one is pretty 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 amazing for strikers also no look is good for strikers so yeah increases breath bar regeneration this is meh it's nothing special this one is a troll like skip it this one too skip it flip ground covers more distance when you're doing a slide yeah it's, it's okay i guess for defenders but it's a nah i don't know Allo allows the user to use shift lock aim further away like i had this it's pretty pretty okay but like you can do something you can get something else it's it, it got nerfed uh, so yeah swerve ball this this is like curving the ball with a and d it's okay i guess but it's not not really good because you can only do it like the in the box area so yeah swifter makes you faster a speed buff simple tank uh you gain an aura of iframe so you cannot be tackled for five seconds this one is decent actually tireless no debuffs when in low stamina that's okay but nobody's using that unpuckable you are harder to steal from with step tackle with step tackle they have to come more closer with step tackle than usual nice easy okay wingspan goalkeeper hitbox increase this one is good for goalies and wind pace ability uh like passive additional speed boost ability if the skill is activated your speed is doubled for a period of time this one is crazy actually you're gonna zoom in the fucking map bro so yeah these are all the badges you can you can get for now also check out the trello for different things like if you wanna like maybe or also the discord server and like if you want to see the stats the levels they're not like anything crazy the max level you can obtain is 15 i'm not sure about that i think it's 10 but maybe it's 15 i'm not sure in order to level up you must win in auto matches when you experience killer coins you can also level up via yeah, events quest 2 there are no quests for now no events i think okay player receives skill points after leveling up which are used to upgrade stats spins which they can use yeah you get one spin by leveling up it's okay killer coins i'm not sure what this is by spins and other stuff in the future okay it's still not done remember this ga uh, this game is still beta so yeah these are the badges prodigy are the players who have the best physique buff stats and can unlock the fullest potentials of themselves they start off with two badges and obtain and able to obtain four badge slots in total one extra than usual they also have a higher chance of, of, of updating the state of low oh wow really cool but yeah i'm not sure like if this is still uh the same because this was like from like month and a half ago so yeah flow flow is the state of which you are in a perfect zone flow buffs your overall stats like speed power muscle etc flow gives you an aura with glowing eyes appearance aesthetic flow is obtained by just playing not entirely sure yet <laughs> yeah it's like i've seen some people use it but it's really rare so yeah and yeah i guess that's it for the video maybe if you guys want to see me play this game more just tell me in the comments and yeah that's it for today make sure to like share subscribe and all that shit you already know it see you guys in the next video goodbye